So how does this nano scaffold actually help the tendon heal back down to the bone for a rotator cuff tear? This is Rotium and it's developed by Atrion Orthopedics. And it's taking a very different approach when it comes to the healing of tendons. It's primarily focusing on the emphasis, which is the part that attaches the tendon back down to the bone. The problem, when a tendon is repaired, primarily using a mechanical repair, anchors and sutures, where the tendon heals back down to the bone where it's attached from, which creates a lot of scar tissue, which isn't very good or efficient at transferring forces. And this type of healing can actually lead to compromised long-term outcomes, such as higher retail rates, which can be up to 35% in rotator cuff tears. But Rotium was designed specifically for this. It's a microfiber matrix that helps the enthesis create new tissue that isn't scar tissue. It's made from two main materials, PGA and PLCL. And 85% of the implant is extremely porous, which allows blood, bone marrow and cells to migrate and be absorbed and soaked into the implant. And then over time, this helps with the healing process. This matrix is completely reabsorbed at three to four months and encourages a stronger bone to tendon interface. The implant is designed to be extremely cost effective for price conscious facilities. It's extremely efficient as the way it's used is integrated directly into a rotator cuff tear with one simple extra step. You do not need any other staples or extra products to be able to deploy it. And lastly, it's a synthetic material, so it doesn't need to be stored in a specific area or specific temperature. Comment below and tell me what you think about this product.